I remember, y'all, in 1980 when I began my transition, when the Revolutionary Act was for me to walk outside my front door. Well, it still is for a lot of Ain't that right? Mm -hmm. But there were very few of us there. Very few of us there. And I never, I was never super passable. I never assimilated. I never wanted to. It was never on my radar. I walked out the way I walked out. And I was thrown in jail many, 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 many times just because I stood on the street. And I wasn't even working. I was walking. <laughs> so I, 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 now I'm at a point in my life, I'm 56 years old. I've been living with AIDS now for almost four decades of my life. I think our community and the long-term survivors like myself, we deserve not explanation, but we deserve some sort of ownership when we ourselves are put through a test of survival all over again by the cis community. Mm.